I want to wish the men and women of the United States Air Force, and specifically the nearly 18,000 airmen serving at Joint Base San Antonio, as well as their families, a very happy 74th birthday. I want to also acknowledge the Air Force veterans who continue to serve their fellow citizens as City of San Antonio employees, including two Air Force veterans serving on our City Council, retired civil engineer Lieutenant Colonel Clayton Perry, who represents District 10, and a former defender, Councilman John Courage, who represents District 9. Since 1947, courageous American airmen have skillfully accomplished the Air Force's mission to fly, fight, and win. Through their selflessness and their service and sacrifice, they have ensured the security of our nation's citizens while supporting our allies. For us in San Antonio, the Air Force has a special place in our history and in the defense of our nation. In 1916, the father of military aviation, Captain Benjamin Fuloy, chose San Antonio to expand the fledgling U.S. Air Force. Kelly Field is named after Lieutenant George E. Kelly, the first American military aviator to lose his life while piloting a military aircraft. Air power does indeed start here in San Antonio, as every enlisted airman in the Air Force begins their career attending basic military training at Lackland Air Force Base. We're also proud of the Air Force's missions conducted in San Antonio that shape the development of airmen and support global military operations. We host the largest joint base in the Department of Defense, Joint Base San Antonio, which is commanded by an Air Force Brigadier General and supports over 260 partners from every branch of the service. All Air Force Security Forces personnel, or defenders, and all Department of Defense's working dogs are trained at Lackland Air Force Base. Air Education and Training Command, or AETC, headquartered at Joint Base San Antonio Randolph, is the primary training and professional education command in the Air Force. More than 48,000 active duty and Air Reserve component members and 14,000 civilian personnel make up AETC. The command has responsibility for approximately 1,600 aircraft. The 16th Air Force, located at Joint Base San Antonio Lackland, integrates multi-source intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, cyber warfare, electronic warfare, and information operations capabilities to ensure that our Air Force is fast, lethal, and fully integrated to defend our nation. The Air Force Personnel Center ensures commanders around the world are provided with skilled airmen to conduct Department of the Air Force and joint missions. This command executes programs covering the entire life cycle of military and civilian personnel, from recruiting and ascension through retirement, including readiness, growth and development, and deployment. Many of the Air Force's citizen airmen perform critical missions and proudly call San Antonio home. These units include the Reserve's 433rd Airlift Wing and the Texas Air National Guard's 149th Fighter Wing. These and other missions in the Air Force executed in our great city, we're proud of them all and we are honored to host them in our city. And today, we join in recognizing our nation's airmen who are bravely serving our citizens and allies around the world. Finally, it's a privilege to celebrate the 74th birthday of the world's premier Air Force here at Military City USA. And we are extremely proud of our city's contributions to the Air Force's motto to fly, fight, and win. Air power, anytime, anywhere. To airmen everywhere, happy birthday.